So as school continued on, I was, I was still not a very good student, and I used my art as a means of basically graduating high school. <laughs> Honestly, it, I, I just I didn't care for it. And, uh, there was no college that would take me, so I wound up going to a little community college called Sand Hills Community College. Oh, Moore County, Southern Pines, it's right up the road. And believe it or not, that is actually where I was born. Really? Mm -hmm. So it was quite ironic to come back and uh, to where I was being worse born. While I was at uh, Sand Hills Community College, I had taken all these various art classes, mostly in ceramics, and that's the direction that I was going into. And then two years later, I wound up transferring to UNCG because I thought, well, I could pursue ceramics, I could get a degree in teaching, and um, maybe do my art. My senior year, this is when it all began, and you can come back to it. Um, not having much money, I decided to do a painting for my mom for Christmas. So I went to Friendly Shopping Center, I bought a 59 cent tray of watercolors, 59 cent tray of watercolors, came back to the door, pulled out a sheet of drawing paper, and that night I did my very first painting. And there was this wonderful snow scene, it was real good. Turned out so well, I went back and I bought a $2.98 frame, <laughs> put it in it, and mom said, Billy, you need to do more. I said, oh, I tell you, I think I found something here. So last semester, I take my life savings, $4.98, and I go and I buy a little set of Grumbarker watercolors, eight tubes of paint, and I began to teach myself how to paint. And one of the deans, I was working in the student union building, saw me painting, and he said, Bill, would you like to be our artist in residence? I said, well, what does that mean? He said, well, we'll pay you $75 and you can have a show at the uh, student union. I said, I'm on. So for eight weeks, I wound up and I did 10 paintings. I borrowed $300 from my brother, framed them all, and I sold every one of them. Wow. And I knew, uh, so you knew you were onto something at that point. I knew this is what I would do for the rest of my life. Uh -huh.